Hello everyone and welcome to another video on the channel. Today I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the new uh, abandoned car in Need for Speed Payback. I have just found it. I have no idea what it is. I haven't even looked at it just yet, so I have no idea what the car is. So um, I've had no clues or anything. I've just literally been looking for this car just just randomly. So uh, I ended up finding it finally. So any, anyway, the, the way I've been doing this is I've been teleporting to every single gas station and every single garage or, or dealership. And I've done like a little loop, like a little small loop around it to try see if it's anywhere there. And I got to this gas station here and I ended up trying to do a loop. And as soon as I drove down this road, it popped up. So finally, uh, by the way, this wasn't like very, very quickly. Like it, it took a while for me to find it. So basically, I just tried to cut out this area here because this is where the previous car actually was. So I didn't want to go ahead and check the same place because I doubt it would be in the same place as before. So basically what I kept doing is I just kept teleporting to gas stations around and I just kept doing like a little loop or like a little small play like area to try to look around and um, waiting for it to pop up and it hasn't popped up. So it did now when I teleported to this one. So here it is, the new abandoned car. Uh, September 4th is when this car was released. So what is it exactly? It's a Ford... No, it's not. <laughs> I'm joking. Um, it looks like it's a GTR. It also looks like it's a drag spec GTR. I've not. It's most likely is one of the bosses cars in the game. So I don't know which one it is. I'm sorry that I don't know the lore of the Need for Speed Payback bosses and all that sort of stuff. But for the people that do know it, then congratulations to you. You'd know what this car is. I'll probably look this up anyway. And I'll put it in the title. What's that license plate say? That license plate is interesting. Vasiliev? Okay, so I'm guessing that's the name of the, the dude who owns this thing. It looks pretty good though. I'm not gonna lie, it it doesn't it doesn't look bad at all. So yeah, this is this is definitely drag spec. Look at those wheels. Um on this thing. That's what instantly gave it away. Yeah, it's uh it's a pretty cool GTR to have. So yeah, this is the new abandoned car. So let's go ahead, get this thing to Rav, and uh, I think I'll max this thing out as well in this video because why not? So Basically, what I have to do is literally just get rid of the cops now and get myself to Rav. So, I'll be right back once I get there, because there's no point of you guys watching me drive this thing all the way to Rav's place. Because it's really far. Oh my god. It is a drag build, so it doesn't really have... Honestly, a lot better than some of the, some of the race builds in the game. Okay, it's... It's pretty fast. So far. But yeah, it, it's, it's a drive though, so... Oh my god, oh my god. Okay, we have Corvettes after us and everything. Okay, you know what, I'll just, I'll just... I'll just say I'll fast travel to it, but obviously I can't. But I'll, I'll cut the video so it looks like I did fast travel to uh, Rob's place. So, anyway, I'll be right back. Alright, that was very, very easy. This is a fast car. Top speed right now on this thing is 219. So I'll show you guys that really quick. Before I go into, into the garage to, to drive... So we're to pretty much just show you guys what this thing is like. Watch this. This top speed of this thing is 219 miles per hour. So it's fairly fast, just out of the box. Brilliant. I didn't reach it. <laughs> Let's try that again. There you go. 220. It randomly hit. Randomly hit 220 this time. When I was driving it on the highway, it was like hitting 219. It's a fairly fast car as it is. Body parts are hanging off it, so that's kind of funny. Uh, but yeah, let's go get this in, finish off our little uh, little mission thing here, and then I'll take it back out again and see how fast this thing actually is. So I'll probably go ahead and build this thing maxed out to level 399. I don't know. I can't remember if I've actually built a GTR before as a uh, as a level 399, but I'll go ahead and I'll do it now. I guess why not? Boom! Smash it into the wall. That's it's cars and bits, anyways. <laughs> All right. Let's have a look. Whose car is this? And uh, it'll tell us now, most likely, at uh, at the top of our screen. No, it's not going to tell us. Anyway, well, yeah, there you go. This is it's a three fifty one, so that's why it's fast. Nine hundred and fifty seven horsepower. Top speed it says two thirteen, but obviously, with some better parts on this thing, we can get this thing to be faster. Yeah, it's a it's a fairly cool car. Not going to lie doesn't really say who who owns this thing. Well, obviously, you can't modify, you can't do anything like that to it, so you're pretty much stuck with the way this thing looks right now. But it doesn't look too terrible. There's been a lot worse GTRs. Uh, I'm not a big fan of the wheels. Um, everything else is actually nice and 
neatly done. There's not really anything that's that's super crazy to this uh, done to this guy to make it look like it's like it's uh, it's bad looking. So uh, yeah, it's uh, it's not that bad. Let's go max this thing out. I want to see how much power I can squeeze out of it. Obviously, I'm not gonna have a lot of parts because I only have sport. Uh, I can't speak. Obviously, I'm not gonna get a lot of parts because I only have four speed cards to trade in. But I can buy some cards. Um, with my money, so we'll try and see if I can use those to get to level 399 or as close to it as possible. Um, but yeah, anyway, let's uh, let's give it a shot. All right, well, this is, I guess, it. This is the fastest I could get this card to be. So zero to sixty is at 1.57 seconds. That's very fast. Uh, 1,157 horsepower. NOS capacity is always maxed out when it's a drag car, but NOS power has gone up quite a bit. Um, top speed is pretty bad, I guess. I could get this thing to be a little bit faster than that. Um, I guess with the with the live tuning and all that sort of stuff. So I can definitely get this thing to be at like 230 or something like that. So I think that's a good idea to do that. Um, everything else, I guess, is it. So I also looked this up. Apparently, this is this is a boss's car. Uh, the dude's name is Mitko Vasilev. Uh, I probably pronounced that name completely wrong, but yeah, this is whose car um, it is. This is. The car belongs to that dude, so it is a fast car. It's a fast accelerating car. It handles really, really well. It handles really, really well on the road. I'm pretty sure I've done a build on this, like a, a drag build on the GTR, so I know exactly what this thing handles like. But I, I don't honestly remember doing it. Either way, it's mad that a drag car in this game can handle this well. There's some, there's some race cars in this game, like race build cars that handle worse than this car. And that's something. That is something. But I, then again, the all-wheel drive definitely helps this thing. So I'll bring it to the airstrip. I want to see how fast this thing actually is. Like, if I can squeeze out like 230 miles per hour, I'll be happy with it. And um, I guess I'll keep it at that for, for this video. Um, let's just try this out really, really quick here. And see what the what the top speed actually is. Uh, which one am I even looking at? I'm supposed to be going this way, right? Alright, let's have a look. Let's see how fast this car can actually go. Try to position myself right in the middle here. Alright, go. I'll let it accelerate as fast as it can to about 200 miles per hour and then I'll hit the NOS. I really thought this would be a little bit faster to 200 miles per hour. Anyway. So 235. And here I go. 363 yards, that is some distance. Alright, well, I guess this is gonna be it. So, uh, thank you guys very much for watching. If you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to like it. If you want to see more videos like this, don't forget to subscribe. And one final look at the location of this thing is that just where this little entrance is at the bottom left of the city next to this drag race, you can just teleport to this gas station here and then just drive down that road. And it should be right here. So, yeah. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.